I called the place that I'm reviewing today the best burger in the Northwest. That was a little while ago. Since then, they've opened another branch. I'm gonna check it out and I'm gonna get a few new items as well. But uh, this is a place that I was in love with. Let's see if it's still good. Consistency is so important. And a lot of these places, they start good and then they just kind of drop over time. Here it is, guys. This is the place I wanna check out. Okay, guys, so we are inside. A um, good amount of seating in here. And I can see the menu like directly in front of me. In fact, you know what? I might even show you the menu and kind of stand up there we'll see if that works because i want to show off some of the things that i think if you come in here you need to try okay guys so my idea i'm trying to show the the menu whilst i was standing up didn't quite work because the actual table being there is actually quite far away so there should be some scans on the screen showing you some of the stuff that i'm going to get today but i've ordered my food and as soon as it comes out we'll check it out i'm hoping this place is as good as i remember because i remember thinking it's one of the best burgers in the northwest guys so obviously i'm here i've got my food i want to drink my brother here he works here introduce yourself to the good people what's your name bro my name is manny so i was after a drink and i was going to get one of the standard ones but you suggested something else yeah what, what what's the plan what are we doing well, we're gonna make mix some of the drinks up and hopefully I'll leave a life here. Yeah. Okay, well the, there's a lot of pressure now bro, because it's not a standard drink, so we'll see. Thank you man. Thank you. Guys, so yeah, stay around for that. I don't know what it's gonna be like to be honest. So okay, this is the Carolina Reaper. This is a sort of spicy chicken burger. And then this is one of my favorite burgers here. Basically, that's just like a plain uh, double cheeseburger. They do things like uh, smoky, like turkey bacon, things like this, but honestly guys, I'm a boring guy. I like the plain stuff. I think you can't beat the classics. They have that option, but for me, wait, wait till we get to it. It's good. I hope it's as good as I remember. I've not had this for a very long time. Starting though, with this. So this has got five Carolina Reaper tenders. So we've got chicken tenders, and they should pack a good amount of heat in these. We've got a little bit of red onion, a little bit of mayo. So oh, all right. That guys is a delicious tender. And honestly, it's got Carolina Reaper for a reason. This is really spicy. It cooked really well. Crispy chicken, but the spice on that is actually quite, quite, uh, it's hot. I'd say one of the spiciest burgers in Manchester is places like, um, maybe like Billy's, it's quite hot. It's quite soggy, it's quite hot. This is hotter than that. If you like your spice, you're gonna enjoy that. I wanna polish this off, probably not now, because I've got a lot to eat, but this is a really tasty chicken burger. Even though it's not a breast, I know a lot of you like a, like a full breast. Because it's got five tenders, it kind of equates to a breast anyway. One of the things that I like to get when I come here, Again, I feel like it's doing this job is hard because, well, it's not hard, I'm very grateful. But one of the things is, if I like a place, I won't turtle back around to it for like a year because my diary should fill up with eating things. So I'm very grateful to do that, but it means that places like this, I don't get to visit very often. These guys, for a long time, have been known as one of the best burgers in the Northwest. They're really popular for a reason. And after I do this, I need to show you something really cute that I ordered as well. But uh, let's see if they uh, still live up to that. Oh, look how juicy that is. Super juicy. The meat to fat ratio on that is, is perfect. It's cooked really, really well. It's really, really soft. We've got some sort of caramelization on the beef. The house sauce is really good. That is getting a hay man all day long. Quick shout out, yeah, to this drink to my brother. He did us good, right? I was calling him out a little bit. I put him on camera. But you sometimes gotta apply a little bit of pressure. This is actually really good. I have no idea what, okay, the top one's green. So I'm thinking, what is green on there? Not a lot, really. The bottom one's probably maybe mango. I don't really know. My bro, sorry, there's another customer here that's got a drink. You don't mind me asking you, what do you think this is? Because he's got the same drink. I can't figure it out. Mango guava, maybe. Yeah, yeah. But the thing is on there, mango looks green, but I don't think it will come out green. But then what's the green one then? No, green's the background. Still, yeah, that, that, yeah, exactly. That's what I'm saying. So it's, that's what I'm saying. I'm saying, I'm saying what you're saying. I'm thinking, right, mango and uh, either passion fruit or guava. I'm all completely wrong, man. Mango, you got right. And then it's not guava or passion. Not either one of them. Where is it from? That. Well, I know it's not Pepsi. Can't be that, guys. I'm trying to figure this out, right? Okay, the secret's not been revealed, but it sounds like you look a bit tight-lipped, man. Off-camera, okay, guys. It's one of the, it's, you're running like, edit it out. Like, it's one of them edit it out kind of one. 
This is this is too much science class. I don't. What makes green? Mango could be green. Yellow could be blue. No, no, can't be. No, no, no. Mango is that one there. I'm not sure. Don't put me on the spot because I'm not sure. I'm not that confident. Guys, we've started a debate here. Guys, so these are the the little mini ones I want to show off. You'll see them there actually, right there. The new smash sliders, right? I don't think it's cool because you've got the regular size one for say like, I don't know, I think the cheesed up is 849 for example. And then you've got the small one here, which is like 349. So why do you have it yourself? Like maybe you've got a chicken burger, you want a little bit of beef, or you've got a beef burger, or a bit of chicken. Salam alaikum, bro. So there's a brother in here. Bro, what's your name? What's your name? Do you want to come on camera? Guys, I want to show you the, the a legend in the in the making, right? Sit down, bro. Sit down, sit down, sit down. Guys, you, this, this, this is worth the wait. Wear the medal, guys. There's a challenge here, which I'm going to do in the next video. So I'm not doing this video. ADCC champion? No, I'm joking. The first person to ever complete... Why are you making him look small for, bro? He's out angling me. And hold on, listen. We're doing this here. So basically, yeah. Um, tell us about the Reaper. If you've, had, if, you've had, if you've had the bomb in one sentence. It's up to you, man. More than one, isn't two, it? Two, one yeah. word, two words, polyneuropathy. It literally, you just feel tingling everywhere. If you've had like a, the bomb, if you've had the final answer, it's not spicy than that. It's not the spice that gets you. It, it literally, I felt like I was gonna fall over. Like you feel tingly everywhere. But then I don't know Algerian genetics. I don't know about yeah, your genetics. Yeah, I, I think I'm probably gonna, I'm probably gonna die. Let's, let's yeah, keep yeah. it real. But did you sign a waiver? Yeah, it's unbelievable. Yeah, I'm gonna do that in the next video. Yeah, yeah, but you're not gonna, are you gonna have the whole burger? You need to have the whole burger. Why bait me out? Everyone's watching, guys. Whole burger. Whether I do or not, it might be the magic of editing. You have to watch him do it. No, we'll see, I'm gonna try my best, but you're, you're the first you. person to do it, you know. Huh? You're the first person to ever do it. Yeah, yeah, no one built like me, bro. John we're, Jones. We're, we're gonna, that's it, we're gonna try. We've got a good meeting, you man. Salam <laughs> brothers. Okay. Thank you. So, anyway, now you've got a preview for the next video. But let's check these out. So this one is the mini chick, kind of is what it sounds like, you know, it's like a mini chicken burger, which again, I think is nice if you're gonna, if you're a beef burger fan and you want a little bit of a burger, or like a little bit of a chicken burger, that could be right up the street. It kind of does what it says on the tin. It's the same tenders, but here they don't have the actual, they're not dipped in a yeah, spice, yeah. Which, is, which is quite nice for a change. And then the beef burger. I think 349 for that is a bit of a bargain. We have 349. It's really good quality. I think it's the same as the obviously the other larger one, but that's much bigger. It's thicker. There's two patties. For a little bit of a taster, you can't really go wrong with that at all. And of course, you get sort of a couple of portions there. You got the curly fries, and then you've got um, I got the, sort of the normal fries. So a nice generous portion. But quick shout out again. This is the one. This is getting a hay man. This drink is lovely. Conclusion, guys. This is still one of the best burgers in the Northwest. That beef burger was as good as I remember, if not a little bit better. And I think the last branch I went to, I don't think had seating. That was in Watchdale. This one has like a lovely amount of seating, you know. The chicken burger was a surprise, though. I didn't expect that to be as tasty as it is in a scene like Manchester, where chicken is so popular. They do a really, really good job. So I would happily recommend this place for you to come down and try it and let me know what you think. What I am going to do is I'm going to do another video to do our spice challenge. I want to check. I think it's going to defeat me, but uh, I want to try. See you in that next video. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Bye, 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 bye.